Hello students, let us learn one property altitude and median of a triangle from class 8th. We will start with the altitude of a triangle. Let us consider one triangle. Let us name this triangle as triangle ABC. Now we have to understand what is altitude of a triangle. As there are three vertices of triangle ABC that is vertex A, vertex B and vertex C. So altitude in the sense a perpendicular drawn from a vertex of a triangle to its opposite side is altitude. So if we draw perpendicular AD from vertex A to its opposite side BC then AD is called as altitude of a triangle. So this is the altitude drawn from vertex A. In the same way we can draw another altitude from vertex B to its opposite side AC. So let BE which is a perpendicular drawn from vertex B to its opposite side AC. So BE is the second altitude. In the same way there is another vertex C. So from that vertex also we can draw a perpendicular to its opposite side AB. So CF is the third altitude of a triangle. So as there are three vertices for a triangle we can draw three altitudes for any triangle. Now the property of these altitudes is that these three altitudes intersect at the same point. So as we can see here these three altitudes intersect at point O. That means these three altitudes are concurrent. That means they intersect each other in one point. So let us have the definition of this point of concurrence of these three altitudes of a triangle. The point of concurrence of altitudes of a triangle is called orthocenter of a triangle and it is generally denoted by letter O. So for this triangle ABC as these three altitudes intersect at point O, O is called as orthocenter. Now let us have the next concept median of a triangle. For that consider triangle PQR. Now if A is the point which is a midpoint of segment QR and if we draw a segment joining A and P, we say that segment PA is the median of a triangle. So we can define a median as a segment joining a vertex of a triangle and the midpoint of its opposite side. So this is called as the median of a triangle. So PA is the first median of triangle PQR as there is another vertex Q. Now suppose point B is the midpoint of segment PR and if we join point Q and point B it is the second median of triangle PQR. In the same way if C is the midpoint of side PQ and if we join RC, RC is the third median of a triangle. Again as we can see here these are the three medians of triangle PQR and they are intersecting at one point and that point is denoted by letter G. We can define the median of a triangle as the segment joining the vertex and the midpoint of opposite side of a triangle is called as median of that triangle. So here also as there are three vertices of a triangle we can have at most three medians of a triangle. So in this figure segment PA, segment QB and segment RC are the medians of a triangle. Now what do we call the point of intersection of these three medians? It is called as a centroid of a triangle. So let us have the definition of a centroid of a triangle. The point of concurrence of medians of a triangle is called the centroid of the triangle. As these three medians intersecting at a single point it is called as a centroid and it is denoted by the letter G. So this is the centroid of the triangle. 